What's up guys, I'm Cosentino. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome to these videos where we go behind the scenes and I give you some insight into, well, my favorite tricks and illusions and death-defying escapes. So if you haven't subscribed to my videos, do that right now. Turn on the notifications because these videos come to you every single week and you really do not want to miss them. With that being said, let's get started. All right, so today we're taking a look at a very iconic illusion known as the metamorphosis or the substitution trunk. Now, it was originally created by John Neville Maskelin. Well, this is kind of the history behind it. However, the illusion is really synonymous with the escape artist Harry Houdini. So the concept was this. Houdini would be placed inside a sack then locked inside a trunk, then placed behind a curtain, and his wife, Bess Houdini, would then get inside the curtain, and a few minutes later, the curtain would be pulled back, and Houdini would be free, and his wife, Bess, would be locked inside the trunk. Now, the locks weren't tampered with, the ropes wrapped around that hadn't been undone, and it was a little bit of a mystery. Over the years, the illusion has become much quicker, where the exchange now takes place in literally seconds. You have the uh, the Pendragons to thank for that. They really kind of amped it up with the physical speed where literally uh, they're standing on top of the trunk, a cloth is lifted, dropped, and a second later, the exchange has taken place. Even with a tear, a rip of the cloth, every iconic magician has performed it. It's kind of like a rite of passage for all stage illusionists. We're talking David Copperfield, we're talking Doug Henning, we're talking Chris Angel, Siegfried and Roy, and the list goes on and on. So my version here is from my TV show, The Magic, The Mystery, The Madness. We did it inside a skate park and I had the owner come in and examine the trunk. There's no trap doors, there's no secret compartments, and then the performance takes place. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Here we go. So I've brought you out here, solid ground. Yep. You can see above, around, below at all times. I want you to check out the trunk. Pete, come around here, look around the back. Make sure it yep. is actually solid. Do me a favor, have a look inside. Solid, solid right. as mate. Okay, so be honest. There's no way that someone could slip in. Not a chance. Someone could slip out. No. All legit, yeah? Legit. Okay, good. All right. Okay, mate. So, with that being said, let's get started. A little bit of dancing to uh, kind of switch it up. You know, so many magicians have done the sub trunk that it's very hard to make it your own. And of course, in the show, I do a bit of movement, a bit of dance. So this is my interpretation. Some people like it, some people don't. I guess points must be given for uh, trying to make it different. <laughs> All right, here we go. Lid is opened. Actually, it was really difficult to dance on the, um, the skate park because it's not 100% even. It's a bit, it was challenging. Okay, so I'm placed inside the sack. Priscilla, of course, when she had red hair. This is going back to 2013. Ties me up, puts me in the sack. Lid is shut. Chains are placed through the lid to keep it tight, so it can't just lift up. Okay, the lock is placed on. The key removed and dropped on the floor, so you realise no key is used to open it up. Clock is lifted. This little stands on top. That's Ash there, one of our original crew members, and. There you go. Exchange takes place. Of course, the trunk is intact. The lock is not undone. The chains are not removed. Remember, it was a solid lid, solid side, solid back. Now, this is a real physical illusion. The, um, the quicker you can physically perform the illusion, the, the faster the exchange looks. So it really comes down to that physicality. Okay, now the 
rope on the sack is still tied up. And there is Priscilla. And it's done in front of a real audience and done surrounded. There's no camera trickery at all. It's uh, all illusionist that can be done in the round. So there you have it, the metamorphosis or the substitution trunk. Magicians call it the sub trunk. And uh, it is a really fun illusion to perform. It's, it's very physical. I like that. I like physical illusions. And um, it, it's, it's just, um, it's just really a, a great piece and always gets a really uh, powerful response from uh, an audience that sees it. It is a classic of magic, so a lot of magicians do it, but I guess it's a classic for a reason, and that's because uh, people really like it. So once again, I hope you're enjoying these videos. This is a really quick one, some insight to the substitution trunk. So if you like the videos, you know, give us a like, uh, keep commenting, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you all next week.